Hi, I'm Dr. Bertice Berry, and I want to tell you a story. My mother had the greenest of green thumbs. A lot like laundry, gardening also skips a generation. I do not, I did not inherit her green thumb, but I saw what she did and she would talk to the plants and she would water the plants and she'd feed the plants and sometimes she'd sit them out in the sun. She would wipe down the plants and really just have conversations with those plants. When my mother died, I did my best to keep her plants alive and I've done a great job of it. I shared clippings and pottings and pieces of her plants with family members and loved ones who loved her and loved plants. Um, my daughter is doing a better job of replanting plants, but don't ask her to water anything because she, she's going to forget. I started a new tradition um, several years back. A good sister's mom passed away. And her mother had given me a really beautiful plant. And for some reason, this plant thrived without much from me. And so when her mother passed away, I began to talk to that plant. And that plant thrived even more. I mean, that plant, I had set it on a really high pedestal. And it came all the way down to the floor and all the way out. It looked like a skirt. So I started this new tradition of taking care of someone else's ancestor through those plants and then giving it back to them. I gave my sister that plant and I said, it's supposed to be with you. It was meant to be with you. And I've continued that. I just shared my nephew's grandmother with him. I had been taking care of this plant that they gave me after her memorial service. And after that service, I had this plant and I was like, why do people keep giving me these plants? But I took care of her and I sat her by the kitchen table where we would all gather on Sundays for dinner and a documentary. And my nephew recently came by with this plant that had been small, but he had to carry it out like that. We just moved another plant over and my granddaughter said, what happened to the other plant? I said, Uncle Nick took her home. And she said, well, who's this? I said, that's Pop-Pop. We got to take care of Pop-Pop and then give them back to Grammy. I love this tradition that came out of something that I thought I didn't know taking care of the plants, talking to the ancestors through those plants. We're entering into the season of Lent. And in this period of time, I allow myself to die to the self, to let the self be renewed, reborn. But to be reborn, some things have to go away. And in each of those instances, the grief that was held around the letting go came back in that embrace. There are seasons and times for everything. And I think we're so busy trying to get to the next thing. We can't really appreciate living without letting something go knowing that love never, ever, ever leaves us. Think about the new creations and traditions that you can create, that you can share, that you can hold on to. I love you.